good morning guys welcome back to my channel and I decided to do another video because I was cleaning I was like it's been almost like two weeks and I haven't put up a video so this video is going to be my 28 29 and 30 week update of my pregnancy I also posted on my Instagram and my snapchat or uh, what video you guys want to see and a lot of you guys said pregnancy update so I'm gonna be doing my pregnancy update so let's just get into the video okay so I'm gonna start with if you see me looking to the side I have my um, updates on my note card because I have a little down because I'm recording off the phone that has the update of my pregnancy so I have to write them down so um, when I was 28 weeks, it says your baby is about the size of a large eggplant by the week By this week your baby weighs Two and one fourth pounds and measures 14.8 inches from the top of the head and to the heels To the heels of her feet and she blinked her eyes So that was my 28 week update um, A couple symptoms I had on my 28 week update um I get out of breath easily like I could be walking and I run out of breath like recording this video I am so out of breath right now um, I get headaches on this side of my head um, I get major heartburns in the middle of the night while I'm sleeping it's just heartburns are the worst y'all like if you're pregnant or if you knew anybody that was pregnant heartburns are the worst it hurt it burns and hurts so bad like I literally cry every night because that's how bad it hurts so I know my daughter's gonna come out with a head full of hair so if she don't I'm gonna be so upset because I had these heartburns and it hurt it like hell um I was craving I'm still craving fruit um now i'm on to craving ice like the crunch ice i don't know if you guys have like a wawa or at your wherever you stay but i have a wawa we have this like crunch crushed ice and i get ice every time i go to work and stuff like that um i still crave candy i still crave fruit um what else um i crave a lot of slushies i crave like popsicles freeze pops Anything sweet and good, I crave. Um, I don't have really have like any like food food craving now. I guess since I'm almost to the end of my trimester, I just crave a lot of fruit and candy and ice and stuff. And so, on week 29, um, it said your baby is about the size. So week 28 and went to and week 29 was my second trimester. So. 29 is the last was my last week of my trimester so it says your baby is about the size of a butternut squash her lungs and muscles continue to mature so yeah um i had the same the same cravings as my 28 weeks um so yeah um my 20 my 28 week and 29 week were my last two weeks is my last two weeks in my second trimester so i craved almost about the same thing but on my 29 week i also um craved a lot of ice and a lot of fruit um a lot of fruit still a lot of candy it was really the same cravings um but my 29 week i just had major headaches and i had major heartburns that's about it i didn't really have like throwing up anymore and stuff like that that I just have this major major headache I also did take my glucose test um glucose test is basically like a sugar test to see how the baby reacts to a whole bunch of sugar and a lot of people said that your baby's supposed to move like crazy but my baby I drunk um it's like different type of flavors I had good I heard good things and bad things about the um glucose test um but the, when I went there, the lady was like, 
do you want orange or do you want Sprite? And I was like, well, let me just go with Sprite because I heard bad things about the orange one and I heard bad things about the red one. And she was just saying, when I offered the red one, a lot of pregnant women throw it up. So she was like, I'm just not going to offer you that. So the Sprite, literally the clear one, the Sprite one tastes, the, it's lime, it's really lime. It tastes just like Sprite. So if you're pregnant and you're getting close to taking your glucose test, I recommend the lime because it literally tastes just like Sprite. Just... A little more sugar to it it's really really sweet it's just a little more sugar to it and they said that your baby was supposed to move like crazy honestly y'all I drunk it in like five seconds went back to sit down and stuff like that played on my phone and my baby probably only moved like three times that's it like that's why I'm like I don't think my baby reacts to sugar that much because she didn't move like literally when people was telling me they was like oh your baby just gonna be so hyper and just moving like crazy my baby didn't really move she only moved like three four times that's it and then her butt went probably back to sleep but yeah so if you're getting close to your glucose i recommend the lime kind but it's all up to you i know different places have different flavors but i know the one that i went to had lime and orange so yeah um wednesday in my third trimester guys i am almost done with my pregnancy i am actually due august 1st so literally i have like two months because it's about to be june i have literally like two months and i'm so excited to meet my baby girl like y'all don't know how so excited i am um this is my last trimester today i am 30 weeks and four days um every wednesday i become a new week so next week i will be next week on wednesday i'll be 31 weeks so i'm almost there y'all um with my 30 week updates all my apartments are i'm sorry if you guys see me looking over there is because i'm looking in my mirror as well because i can see the cars coming down the street and stuff like that um but Every Wednesday, like I was saying, every Wednesday I become a new week because my due date is actually August 1st and it's on a Wednesday. So yeah, every Wednesday I become a new week. So the Wednesday, the next Wednesday that's coming up, I will be 31 weeks. And then, so all my apartments now are tw twice a week. No, two weeks. All my apartments are two weeks apart from each other. And when I get 35 weeks or 36 weeks, all my apartments, I'm going to see the doctor like almost every week. I go to see the doctors every two weeks now. Um, so it says on my 30 weeks, it says your baby is about the size of a large cabbage. Baby weighs almost three pounds. Her eyes slightly continue to develop. Um, stuff like that. And now she's she's very, very active. Like my daughter is so active. Like I could be laying down. And she would be like moving like crazy like when I'm at work she really doesn't move but I was surprised yesterday when I was at work she was moving like crazy so I was just like wow that surprised me normally when I move she don't really move but yesterday she was moving and it was shocking because I was showing like everybody in my job wanted to see her move and I showed them that she was moving so that was really lovely, but like, she moved like crazy when I'm laying down or watching TV or playing the games on my phone. She moved like crazy. Um, I know certain stuff I eat, she moves. Like, she loves the freeze pops. Like I said, when I eat freeze pops, she moves like so crazy. Um, she's very active, so I know I'm going to have to put her in like gymnastics or some type of cheer or dance thing because she's very, very active. Um what else um my 30 week symptoms um i still i get these headaches i get these minor headaches i have to go to the doctor when i go back to the doctor on june 4th i have to tell my doctors about these headaches because these headaches are ridiculous and my mom say i don't eat enough but i eat a lot so i don't think that's it um i don't know i just get these headaches um my blood pressure be super super low um last time i went to the doctor my blood pressure was 97 over 57 so that's really really low if you guys know your blood pressure normal blood pressure supposed to be like 120 over 80 that's a normal that's a normal blood pressure for a person like 120 over 80 um 97 57 that's like that's too low and plus i'm pregnant and it can defect the baby um like i said 30 weeks i get these heartburns um 
I get them every time I go to sleep. Like, literally every time I'm laying down and I go to sleep, I get them. Um, sometimes I be too lazy to get up in, in the middle of the night and go to the kitchen to eat a spoonful of mustard. So I technically just drink on water, but water doesn't help the heartburns, but I still get them. Um, last night, I didn't go to sleep by 2 o'clock because of how bad the heartburns were really were. Um, sorry if you hear the background. Sorry if you hear the background noise, but anyways, um, what else? I still create the same things, freeze pops. Oh, and I get hot really, really fast. Like, now that I'm getting bigger and I was there, I get hot super fast. Like, I could be just, like, right now I'm hot. I'm out of breath. Like, I'm really trying to finish this video so I can turn back on my fan. I don't want my fan to make noise in the video. But, yeah. Um, also, uh, what else I crave for my 30 weeks? I don't know. I think that's it. So, I'm gonna show you guys an update on my stomach. So this is my stomach. So if I look for my stomach, this is my stomach. This is my stomach, guys. So yeah, I'm getting freaking huge. Um, I put on a lot of weight during my pregnancy. A lot of people don't see it, but me because i know i was skinny before i got pregnant so i know i put on a lot of weight uh, when i went to the doctor i weighed 121 so i gain i'm gaining pounds y'all i'm gaining pounds it's just after i have this baby can i maintain the weight that i did gain so i don't know because i was really, really small so i think once i have the baby i'm just gonna drop down back to my normal size hopefully i don't hopefully i stay to the size um i don't have any stress marks um I do scratch my stomach sometimes, but my mom is like, don't scratch your stomach, but once I scratch my stomach, I go put oil on it, so I thank God that my daughter didn't give me stretch marks. Um, what about it, guys? Um, oh, I did change my daughter's name, so you guys want to see the real name of my baby? I actually changed her middle name. Um, so it's Aviana Zavea Sanders, so that is her officially name, so yeah. But um, I thank you guys so much for staying tuned to this video. I thank you guys so much for being very, very patient with me. I know I've been busy trying to get these videos up. But I thank you guys so much. You guys are so lovely to me. Um, please give this video a thumbs up. Um, if you also want to see a label, a labor and delivery vlog or like a living delivery story, please like this video so I can do the video as well. Also comment down, comment down below for any other pregnancy videos you want to see, and please subscribe to your girl channel. And I thank you guys for watching this video. Bye.